Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm gonna show you all um, an updated hair routine. The last time I've done that, I've cut it since the last time. And I just thought, let's show you all what I use now and whatever. My curls have changed a lot since the time I cut it. So just thought that let's, you know, okay. Let's get right onto the video. So first, I'm just gonna comb my hair and split it through the middle. So I washed my hair with the Shea Moisture Coconut and Hibiscus Shampoo and Conditioner. And now I'm just going to start off with the leading conditioner. I have this uh, Contou Shea, Shea Butter. I don't know how to say that, already, but whatever. The leading conditioner with pear cream. I'm just going to take. A dime size, or whatever you call that. Like this product smells so good. So good. Well, I tend to go towards products I like the smell of, but like it smells. Really good. Next, um, I'm going in with this cream. This is the Bumble and Bumble Defining Cream. This all smells really good, but it's really hard to get out. Thank you, it's not empty. I really tend to focus on the inside um, because that's the most dry and the back of the head is really dry. And then the last product I use is the Curling Enhancement Smoothie, also from Shea Moisture. The coconut and hibiscus one is like, you know. Uh, normally I would use a gel as well, or instead of the cream, as last a gel. But the gel that I have was Diva Curl. Um, and I don't know if y'all know the whole thing about Diva Curl being that it makes your hair fall out and stuff, but since then I'm kind of scared of using it, so I don't. Um, so I'm trying to find a new gel. So if y'all have any suggestions, let me know down below. Let me know down below. Okay. So when everything is in, I go back a little bit and flip my hair to one side. <laughs> okay. Okay, but for real, I just fell almost. I for real, I just almost fell off my chair. That was kind of scary. And then I just flip it forward like this and start cruising. Um, my hair doesn't have too much volume from itself, so scrunching really helps. And I would rather have a little more frizz than have my hair flat. I don't know. I would rather have frizz than flat. And sometimes I finger coil some of the pieces that are still a little bit frizzy or just that frame your face. Up. These. So that's all I do. That's that. Those are the products that I use. Um, I don't diffuse my hair that often because I never have time to. Uh, so I just let it air dry. So I think I'm gonna do that right now. And then I'll be back when it's dry. I'm back. Hi. Okay. <laughs> so these are the final results of my hair. I feel like they look pretty good. I'm gonna fluff it with my pick. Oh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, if you want to see more of me, let me know down below. And also, if you want to see more of me, what you want to see. That's also very helpful. Uh, so, yeah. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you on the next video.